right, what is up, my fellow YouTubers? You already know what this is. I have the keynote uh, synced up right here. I'm going to watch the whole entire keynote. And I'm going to let you know what I think as I'm watching it. So, no, we're not going to be here for two hours. You guys are probably going to be here for like 20 and just see my reactions okay so it's 94 minutes yeah so it's like an hour and a half all right here we go here we go by the way while this gets started i have my tea right here that i will be sipping on i see a lot of chinese people with ipads and iphones what you just saw on that video was the opening of our latest store in westlake china okay it's in hanzhou china it Hanzhou. is an incredible place and it's a gorgeous new design. The architecture is amazing with a cantilevered second floor. It's absolutely <sighs> breathtaking. Cool store. We love HBO. Over the years, they have created groundbreaking shows that have shows. really become, and of course, Sex in the City. Why does he talk like that? And coming next. Oh my God. Eight minutes in and they're still talking about HBO. Apple TV has become the category leader. We've sold over 25 million units just so far. And it's got a very attractive entry level price of $99. So we are lowering the price today to $69. Still get a Chromecast for fucking, what, 30 so bucks? It, Apple TV is a failure. Is iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus are widely considered the best smartphones in the world. Recently, I have to agree. we sold our 700 million iPhones. <laughs> now, one of the great new features that our customers love about the iPhone 6 Plus is Apple Pay. <laughs> Not Apple so much, Pay bro. Forever. HomeKit. Oh, it's changing geez, the good. way we control our devices at home. Better than and we're working so with far. the leading announced that their products will support help, uh, which will support HomeKit at <laughs> Now, perhaps mm. the most profound change. It's fun to see and Tim could mess up his words. <laughs> medical research. And to tell you all about this, I'd like to invite Jeff Williams up. Jeff? <laughs> I know medical research is not what you were expecting, but uh, let me explain. When we were working on health kit, we talked yeah, to a lot explain, of medical bro. experts for time. 30 um, minutes in. We wanted anybody, and anywhere, nothing, regardless no of the announcements. Platform they're on what is this? So we're actually going to make this open source. <laughs> great, great. Congratulations. Let's just take a minute. I am now downloading 8.2. So we'll see what it has to offer. Next up. Here we go. I'd Come like on. to talk about the Mac. Okay. Let's do this it. This is the strongest Mac lineup we ever have had. We challenged ourselves to take everything that we had learned in designing iPhone and iPad and do something incredibly ambitious and bold. What is this? What is this? Whoa. Is that a touchable screen? What is it? What is it? Yo, that, that better not be it. Here it is. Can you even see it? I can't even feel yeah, it. Yeah, I can see it. There it goes. I'd like. I'd like oh, to like man. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Why? Oh, Apple. Oh, Apple. Oh, Don't get me wrong, it looks cool. I'm I so guess. excited to tell you all about this incredible new MacBook. The new MacBook weighs just 
two pounds. Yes. Two pounds, dude. Really? This uh, is the my surface we have ever made. My surface is not and even two pounds. Even at its thickest point, it's just uh, it's twenty four percent thinner. What are they doing? How much, much is it? That's what I want to know. A beautiful keyboard. So the team I don't know how much it is. Current keyboard is great. Oh, butterfly but now there's mechanism. Something new. Our team. It is forty percent thinner, allowing us to make a thinner keyboard. And we also made the keycap larger, making it even easier to strike and get a beautiful typing experience. So this is a slow motion video of typing on the new keyboard on the new MacBook. The keys are much more precise. Absolutely no much travel. More accurate, even if you strike them on the side. There's no travel at all. It is a beautiful keyboard. Are you, are you kidding even me? Even in the dark. 40 pixels. Why not just a Retina Mac MacBook Air? 3.3. This is the thinnest display we've ever built into a Mac. Congratulations, man. And those man. pixels have a larger aperture. Why don't you get what? thinner, fucking it's Phil Schiller? Well, I can't even really be talking, but you're red, fucking fat. So the same it's level picture. of likeness. The technology behind this is a brand new standard called USB-C. It's not standard yet. Like the number of other companies have all worked Fuck. together to create this new industry standard. And you're going to see it appear in more products. Everybody's just getting First around a USB-3. USB-3. Here's the... comes in silver, space gray, and a stunning gold. Yes. Mm -hmm. Here. Trend. Ooh, commercial time. The new oh, no, Johnny Ive. is the result of a collective obsession. It's a product that couldn't exist without invention across many disciplines. So if you swipe up from the bottom of the watch face, you... Haha, <laughs> you're still not as funny as Steve Jobs, so stop trying. I need one. You can mark them one. unread, you can flag them, or you can delete them and get rid of them. <laughs> oh, I need an Apple Watch. <laughs> But there's when can I pre-order? Tell ways me to when. When can I buy this? Steve Jobs would never let this amount of people up on stage. How did the Apple Watch help you? Like she is not that important. Eighteen hours. Uh, and at the end of the day, that could be better. There will be limited quantities of the Apple Watch edition. It is priced from ten thousand dollars, and it will be available in select retail stores. 10,000, whoa! Watch edition is the most beautiful expression. Holy sh Apple, 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 Apple. You have disappointed me over the past years. I don't think I'm as disappointed as I thought I would be, but I am still disappointed I feel like Apple should have done what everyone was thinking they were going to do was a hybrid, a MacBook Air hybrid, or just add a retina display to the MacBook Air. Uh, I will probably have a full reactions video with my brother LB, uh, just so we can both, you know, state our opinions on each of these products because they announced the it's a lot of stuff to take in i just watched it so it's a lot of stuff to take in. i have to think about it i can finally go on youtube and see all the videos and uh see the videos from the the press conference of people actually holding it hands on uh the macbook i mean uh, and then as far as the apple watch uh i don't know it's kind of still up in the air I don't know if the ends justify the means. Uh, you know, I, I can just pull my phone out of my pocket to do exactly the same thing without spending the money. All right, guys, I'm going to go edit this video. Hopefully, it's not too long. Uh, I'm going to just, you know, really shrink this thing down. Uh, there wasn't much to react on because this was all speculated. I knew they were going to talk about the Apple Watch. Didn't know about the MacBook. I thought I was going to be a hybrid. I thought I was going to. I was just really disappointed with what they said or what they announced um, about that product. Uh, I do like the fanless design. That's always something I've had a gripe about uh, with the with the Surface. But then again, this is a whole different. This is a whole different thing entirely. That's about it for now. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Let me go edit this. This has been Brandon G. This is my reactions, my opinions on Apple's March 9th Spring Forward keynote. Thank you again for watching. 
Let me go edit this. Have a great day. Peace.